What's up guys, welcome back to another Destiny 2 video, with today's topic of looking into the brand new perk called the Sundering Glare, which is a handy mod for taking into endgame and has some great stack of potentials for all types of builds in mind. What this seasonal artifact mod does is allow you to debuff an enemy by 20% when you land rapid precision hits against distant enemies for a short duration. In terms of its duration, this varies from weapons with sniper rifles requiring 3, scouts requiring 4, and hand cannons requiring 3 precision shots to activate it. You need to be at least 15 to 40 meters to pull this off and you'll know you have met the requirements as a sort of blue glow appears for a short time and then you have the mod's effects which lasts for 10 seconds. Once the debuff is gone, you do have to wait a few seconds before being able to reapply it once again. Now what makes the mod worthwhile is the stacking effect it has with Titan Bubble, Radiant Well, Divinity and Focusing Lens. And this means that a team of 6 for a raid who have the follow mods and supers available can all make full use of each other's abilities and easily burn through certain bosses, or content slightly more quicker. The great thing about this mod is that everyone who have a free 6 slot class armor can place this on and always have it available whenever you need to, and thus you and everyone else will be greatly benefiting from it from the get go. If you're playing solo or even grouped, just whack it on and enjoy the buff. If you want to know generally just how powerful you can become with the mod, here's a great example of basically being able to be a debuffer for your team. Now, use a Titan or Warlock for Bubble or Well, have Divinity so you can add on a 30% debuff and the Sun of Glare mod for a 20% debuff, and then use a Scout Rifle, Hand Cannon or Sniper with Triple Tap or 4 times the Charm perk. You should now have two options in terms of debuffing an enemy of your choosing, and then with the following weapons that have triple or fourth time charm perk, you can do some serious damage over time as long as you keep hitting your crits. Plus, using Divinity and Sunder and Glare together will equal a 50% debuff on any enemies you put it off, so that's some serious damage you can pull off from there. If you're into endgame content or just solo content and you want to do some serious damage over time, I recommend you get this mod. Go ahead and find a super subclass, pick a weapon that can activate it, and then go to town from there, you honestly won't regret it. So if you enjoyed the video then please leave a like and a sub, and also follow me on Twitter to keep up to date with Destiny content if you dig that type of stuff, link is down below. But once again thank you for stopping by, and I'll see you on the next one.